so welcome to today's video guys today i will be cooking sweet chicken and as you can see i already have the chicken here and i'm cutting it in smaller pieces and i'm also using my hands to cut it i'm not using the board because it's a whole chicken so i'm cutting through the joints to get the pieces in the right sizes and to how they're supposed to be this type of chicken is a hard one and it's much better to boil it first so that it gets soft if it was a softer chicken it would be much easier because i will just go ahead and fry it yes so if you like to use the board you can go ahead and use it if it's easier for you but as for me i like to do it you know manual just the way you see sorry the board is sliding but next time i think i'll put something under so that it doesn't slide so if you want to follow up the recipe very well i put it in the description box and you can find it and you know try this recipe for yourself yeah so i will put it in the pot Yeah, done here with water and here I have black pepper and garlic two cloves of garlic and one onion when I'm boiling it I like to put in a few ingredients so that um, they can get inside the chicken and also give it a nice aroma yes Guys, I hope you had a wonderful day or evening or whichever time you're in over there. So I put in salt and I also like to boil it with the salt so that the salt can enter the meat very well. So guys, I have my hot oil in a pan and I used like 50 ml of oil, not so much really. Yeah, because I don't like so much oil in my food. So. So I will fry it. And let it turn uh, its color to golden brown. As you can see here, it has already started turning, which is a good thing, you know. So it's how it's supposed to be. Yes. I don't know how you guys like to cook it but you can also tell me in the comment section so that I see the different way you like to do your chicken so I put in the onions and also I had to put in the onions uh, because at this point it was starting to get a little bit tacky and I don't want to burn it. Look guys. I can't wait. I'm hungry. Yes, so we'll put in the carrots also. And mix it together so I put in also the tomatoes and I used tinned tomatoes because the fresh ones can be a little bit uneasy to keep during these quarantine days so I used a tin of um, tomatoes 
and they were four pieces inside. If you have the fresh ones and you like to use them, you can use them. I also normally use fresh ones, but this time I did not have fresh ones, you know. The situation is like that, yeah. But these ones also work just fine. Yes. So I add in also the tomato mark or tomato paste. Sorry, <laughs> that was tomato mark. Haha, <laughs> Deutsch word. So I will add in seasoning right now and black pepper so all the right amounts of the things that I put in are in the description box I will put them there so guys this is how it has turned thank you for watching subscribe ciao